In this program, we're trying to determine the change in the entropy of a system during the first second of heat transfer. First, we must find the rate of heat transfer through the barrier. To do this, we realize that the rate of heat transfer depends upon what the barrier is made of, the area of the barrier, the difference in temperature between the two sides of the barrier, and the thickness of the barrier. All of that information can be found here. It tells you what the barrier is made out of and its conductivity constant. It shows you the temperature on the two sides of the barrier. It shows you the depth and height of the barrier and how thick the barrier is. Okay, so then we work through our K, our area, our difference in temperature, our thickness in meters. We get the rate at which heat is passing through the barrier. So in one second, this will tell us how many joules move through the barrier. To get the change in entropy, we do for the left side, delta S equals Q over T. For the right side, we use the same formula. They both see a heat of 94,130. For the left side, it's losing heat, and the temperature is 286. On the right, it's gaining heat, and it has a temperature of 278. So on the left, we lost 329 joules per Kelvin for the delta S. And on the other side, we gained 338 joules per Kelvin. So the net change in entropy for our entire system is 9. You plug this in and make sure you did it correctly.